Colin is running late for work as he chose to drive instead of walk and opting to run his Ford Fiesta on diesel instead of petrol to save money certainly didn't help. He needs to get into the store quickly as he accidentally left the shop open all night and is worried that illegal rodents may have entered the store. But it's business as usual. You want some fish, do you? Fish aren't gay. Some people are looking for fish, but Colin is looking for love. Relationships. Yeah, no, they have been tricky. As a businessman, running up like a pet store and stuff is 24-7. You know, sometimes, you know, three or four days a week as well. So it's very busy. You don't have a lot of time for relationships with women and stuff. But, you know, I used to be married, you know, with my first wife, Tina. But, um, you know, she, she left me. Colin's first wife was an arranged marriage, arranged by the SPCA. She took half of everything, leaving Colin with half of nothing. Then Colin lost a lengthy court battle, enabling her to give back the other half. But Colin is back on the relationship horse. So I've been on the Tinder media, you know, where you, you meet people and you swipe and like, you know, well, she's all right, you know, she's all right. So look, yeah, no. <laughs> Colin has been advised to set his search to ages 25 to 95, within a 12,000 kilometer square radius. And they've got my own profile on there as well, they can see me, what I look like and stuff, and, and how I operate, you know, as a businessman. So this is me, this is, that, this is what they'll be swiping on when they swipe on it. Because <laughs> they haven't been in a relationship for a long time, haven't, haven't had the, like, the sex and stuff. So I'm kind of just being, you know, I've seen, the, I've seen the animals having the sex, I've seen you know, the guinea pigs and stuff, they, they do the sex all the time, but I, I, there's not a lot of sex for me. If you know, it's just going to be good to have sex. Hey, Colin, what are you going to wear? What am I going to wear? Oh, no, just, just the stuff, you know, just my natural stuff. Oh, and no, my shoes as well. I'll wear my, like, my party shoe, like a multi-shoe. Colin has designed a pair of multi-shoes, which suit all occasions. They wouldn't look out of place at a black tie award ceremony. They're ideal for boating and, of course, watching multi-sports events. You've got your multi-shoe, you've got your, your dress shoe on the top here. It's a leather. Well, it's not leather, it's a lino, but it's like a leather, leather, leather shoe there. The left shoe's impressive, but Colin's made some improvements to the right shoe. Yeah, so this is more like the prototype model, but this is a new improved one. It's the ultimate multi-shoe. It's got the sports, sports heel and the your dress bit there. So it's like the Swiss Army knife of shoes, Colin? Yeah, exactly. It's got the, the screwdriver as well. For your odd jobs. And, and it's these multi-shoes that Colin will be wearing on his big date. Yeah, so I better get back in there and get the store sorted. Colin's Tinder date has arrived a little early, which is ideal as it gives Colin the chance to check her out from behind the heavily discounted fish. He's not disappointed. She's a beautiful lady. <laughs> Colin's nervous, but now it's the moment of truth. Nerves have got the better of Colin. So for some inexplicable reason, he has grabbed his potential date's breasts. But perhaps his impressive multi-shoes will save the day. I, just hold down, I'll go get my stuff. Sensing things are back on track, Colin lets on he has a surprise. Surprise for you? Yes. He then heads back for some Dutch courage in the form of a long neck Ranfurly draft. This is the happiest day of his life, but then, drama. It seems Colin's only date in 12 years has left him at the altar, so to speak. In this case, the worm pill display stand. Colin's surprise dinner for two is once again a lonely dinner for one. How do you feel, Colin? Colin's not in the mood for chat. He just wants to shut the world out. Colin will be closing early today. He's a hamster man. Have you seen all the other Hamster Man episodes yet? If you haven't, check out the links below. Slow down, Hamster Man. Indulge in some uneasy listening. Lee Hart and Jason Hoyt in the afternoon. Radio Hauraki. Get into the music.